This is a true story. Of 19 students. Traveling to Europe. With Mitch. And Lady LaFay. When people stop being polite. And, and start, start getting real. real. The real world. Italy and Greece. Greece. To be honest, I'm sick and tired of the word schmammered. If I hear it one more damn time. I'm Shamface. So schmammered. I am the king of schmamtopolis. How many breezers have you had today? 17. How many shots deep are you guys? This many. Whoa. How about you? I'm so sick and tired of everyone asking me to borrow my stuff. It pisses me off. It makes me pretty mad that I let, I don't even know who borrowed it. Casey borrowed it first, I guess, and then Lexi borrowed the shirt afterwards. See, you can't even give me your own stuff. I know. I am going to start getting real in this real world. And it's pissing me off. I mean, yeah, I'm kind of done with that. Hey, I know they say, oh, sorry, but. Okay, sorry, sorry, you're not. Can I borrow this? Because I, I know we're going and we have bathing suits and I'm having it look really cute. Yeah, it looks great on you. I mean, I think it would be really cute. So this girl named Seabird from Cookville, and she doesn't know what Stephen she wants. So, Dunbar, one second she's for Poe, the next she's for Stephen Dunbar, and then Mary Catherine's up his dad. Some action. <laughs> Seabird. Josh <laughs> <Love Joe that>. Mammer. <laughs> Seabird. Everybody on this trip is so ridiculous. Even Mitch. Can you believe him? He totally ditched us at lunch today. And yesterday. Hey, I'll see you guys in about three hours. <laughs> yeah, and then you just get up and leave us. Like, what the hell? We should separate for lunch because it's easier that way. Yeah. Even though we sat in a restaurant when no one was around. Yeah. Mitch did. I, I believe the term for that is called a Mitch bitch. Mitch bitch. Mitch, Mitch ditch. ditch. <laughs> I just had to get rid of them. I feel like we're in fat camp, don't you? I haven't eaten in three days. I'm on an all liquid diet. Uh, all of his water. I just chose! <laughs> she just stole my cracker. I just want to know where my luggage is. I'm so tired of Caitlin coughing. <coughs> Does anybody have any cough syrup? Let me tell you a secret. Claudia, deathly afraid of nuns. We're all goddamn night. Why? Oh my god! Steven! <laughs> So I haven't had my luggage for about 13 days. I just, I just want to go into it. Um, I came in with the clothes on my back and my backpack. And that bitch of a waitress was like, I'm sorry, honey, we're going to have to check your baggage because there's not enough time or not enough space. I'm like, okay, whatever. And where, where, where is it going to go? Oh, I'll just pick up in Detroit. Uh, no, she wants to send it to Rome, okay? We're, we're in Detroit right now, and we have a Connect flight. I've been wearing the same shoes for about eight days. Um, I'd love to brush my hair. Toothbrush is great. I like my own deodorant, right? that's a good one. Um, yeah, so I better get the luggage back, and I'm gonna be pissed if I don't have it at home at least. And that's about all I have to so. say. I just missed Titsiana. I had Ned nightmares last night. Thanks, Caroline. Yeah, it was really uncomfortable. No, we only spoke Greek, so we had this Greek lady like kill him off for us. Yeah. After much deliberation, I've decided to go with the you know the only choice that's a real man, and that's Stephen Dunbar. Stop. Start touching my crap like that. Dunbar. Tell me what happened. Nothing happened. You have to make a promise to each other. I'm close.
but not as bad as them. I'm drawing smiley faces. Ah! You need to get Brittany. Uh, Short 